What's up everyone? Welcome back to Emojis 101, the only video series giving you the meaning behind emojis so you're not confused when you're messaging people. I'm Matt Shaver and today's emoji is the triangular flag on post emoji or as everyone actually calls it, the red flag emoji. The literal meaning of this emoji is just that. It's a red flag. It's supposed to represent the flags you see on golf courses that mark where the holes are. But even though that's the actual meaning, that is very rarely how it's used in conversation. Most people use it to represent a figurative red flag, something that someone says or does that should notify you that you may want to look for someone else to be in a relationship with. These type of red flags can signify that this is not a normal person you're interacting with and you should probably get out while you still can. For example, if you were on a first date with someone and they said something like, yeah, every night before I go to sleep, I put peanut butter in between my toes. That would be a red flag. Or if you were texting someone and they say, yeah, I haven't talked to my parents in 20 years because I think they're lizard people from underground that are bent on destroying the human race. That would be a red flag. This emoji became very popular in October of 2021 when people began sharing their red flags on Twitter. For example, water is nasty to me, red flag. Or a side tooth is missing, red flag. So whenever you see someone post, when he blank blank blank, followed by red flag emojis, basically they're saying whatever that blank 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 was, they consider that to be a red flag. So to reiterate, red flags figuratively in relationships signify things that you should look out for when trying to find your potential partner. The reason this blew up and got so popular on Twitter is because not everyone agrees on red flags. For example, I think it's a red flag if somebody owns more than one cat, but there might be people out there who own 10 cats and someone looks at them and goes, I would love to date that person. There's also a name for those people. They're called psychopaths. So since there was a lot of disagreement about what's a red flag or a deal breaker or something that's not a problem at all, it started a lot of conversation and then everyone started sharing their red flags. You can find thousands and thousands of red flags that people have shared all over Twitter. Most of them are hilarious, but some of them you may not agree with. So get online and share what you think are the biggest red flags in a relationship. And do it soon because most brands have already hopped on this trend, which means it'll be dead in a couple days. That's gonna do it for today's video. I hope this helped you guys understand what the red flag emoji means. I know a lot of people were confused because it got so popular this past month, but if this did help you, please like it and share it with a friend. If you wanna see more emoji videos like this, please subscribe and hit the bell notification button and leave a comment down below with what you consider to be a red flag. I love these things. I wanna see what you guys consider to be red flags. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Thank you.